Who wants to vacuum? No one. That's what robot vacuums are for. Vacuuming is one of the most loathed household chores. Sure, it doesn't carry the Ike factor of cleaning the toilet or the tedium of dusting. But pushing and dragging a noisy, cumbersome vacuum is its own kind of torture. Robot vacuums don't have unwieldy cords or hoses to contend with, and they require little effort from you. You can run one from your couch using a physical remote or smartphone app and the higher-end models can be programmed to wake up and start cleaning without any intervention at all. Robot vacs easily dispose of the most common household detritus, food crumbs, pet hair, dust, making them ideal for both routine maintenance and quick cleanings when you're expecting company. Keep watching to see which robot vacuums made the cut. All those featured have been tried and tested by us, and we wouldn't include any that we're not happy to have roaming around our own homes. And as always, you can check pricing for any of these products in the description below. And if I'm able to get any discounts or coupon codes, I'll include those for you as well. Now let's get started. Number 5. Ufi RoboVac 11S For those seeking a robot vacuum on a budget, the Ufi 11S is worth considering. At a reasonable price and often discounted, you'll be hard pushed to find anything cheaper on the market. That's not to say the affordable price tag means compromising on dust pickup. On test, it picked up dry oats from a medium pile carpet, and a hard floor with ease, and finer dust made from flour and cookies was also no problem for it on a hard floor. Although it wasn't as good on carpets, it's slim too, meaning it has no problems cleaning under furniture with low clearance. However, with a smaller dust bin compared to other models on the market, and no app control or integration with voice assistants, there are some compromises to be made for the low price, although that will be music to the ears of those that want a simplistic robot vacuum. It doesn't take the same logical path around the home when cleaning as other more expensive UFI models do. Sometimes it'll go in straight lines and sometimes seek out the edges of a room, while on occasions, it'll travel in circles, which means it may take slightly longer to clean the whole room or floor. Also, it wasn't always that good at moving around objects. Low-level things seemed to fox it the most, such as deep pile rugs, piano pedals, and pet food bowls. Number 4. iRobot Roomba 694 Robot Vacuum The iRobot Roomba 600 series, which includes this particular model, consists of affordable, durable robot vacuums that do exactly what vacuums are supposed to, pick up debris from carpets and hard floors. This is thanks largely to the two counter-rotating brush rolls, a unique feature for a vacuum in this price range. In our testing, the iRobot Roomba 694 did a great job cleaning up all the debris we spread on the floor, whether it was sand, hair, or cereal. It maneuvered well around furniture, including small chair legs, although it did have some trouble when going around the edges of the rug and transferring to or from the hard floor. This robot vacuum is not as smart as some of its competitors. It doesn't come with smart mapping or object avoidance, features that typically come at a much higher price point. Instead, it travels around your home in no particular order and then heads back to its dock once the battery begins to run low. While some might prefer the more predictable coverage you get from mapping robot vacuum cleaners, this less expensive pick achieves the same goal at the end of the day, albeit a bit more chaotically. We found that this basic model didn't have any trouble finding its dock at the end of a cleaning cycle, and that it hardly got stuck at all. You can connect this device to your Wi-Fi network and use the accompanying app to turn it on or off and set a schedule. It's also compatible with voice assistants such as Amazon Alexa and Google Assistant. We found it easy to set up and use the app right away. I felt like an expert using this robot vacuum within the first couple of times. The dustbin is easy to remove and empty, but we recommend cleaning the brush rolls at least once a month, as hair can build up and affect the vacuum's performance. We were so impressed with the amount of hair and dirt this robot picked up that it is replacing their existing vacuum cleaner. I decided to get rid of my cheap stick vacuum and just use the Roomba because it picks up way more dirt and hair on its own than the stick vacuum did. Number 3. Shark AI Ultra Robot Vacuum XL Even before the first test, we admired Shark IQ's compact footprint and streamlined design. Impressive for a model with a self-empty bin which is often bulky and does not look great in the living room. It was ready to go after only 6 hours of charging and with just the press of one button, off it went mapping our test spaces and smoothly navigating not bumping its way around and under chairs and other objects we put in its path. It had no problem cleaning under kitchen cabinet toe kicks or figuring out how to clean tight spaces without getting stuck. 
though the LiDAR sensor at the top of the robot does make it a little too tall to get under some furniture. After methodically covering our test floors, the shark positioned itself back on the dock and emptied every speck it picked up. Not only did it pick up what we put down, but it went back to nab one straggler that it missed on its first pass. Take note that as it empties the dustbin, it is quite loud, but it should only last about 20 seconds or so. The dustbin in the self-empty base is extra large to hold more debris, and is easy to remove and empty. The filters in the robot and self-empty base are washable, but only the one in the base is a HEPA filter. Other notable features include its self-cleaning brush roll that prevents the hair tangles we see on other robots, and an ultra-clean mode that goes back and cleans the same area three times to get the most thorough clean possible. The Shark Clean app makes this robot extra customizable, but for users who prefer not to use an app, you'll find that the AI Ultra has a lot less to offer without it. Through the app, you can select which rooms you want cleaned and which you don't. Send the robot out to tackle high traffic areas that need deeper cleaning or messes you need picked up in a hurry and you can even schedule cleaning sessions ahead of time. Number 2. Roborock S7 Until the Roborock S7, most of the hybrid robot vacuums mops we've tested have been good, but not great at either task. The S7 is the first such device we'd actually trust to vacuum and mop without close supervision. That's because the S7 is smart enough to know when it's on a rug, and can lift its mopping pad so that your carpet doesn't get soaked. As a vacuum, the S7 was pretty good. It's not the best with pet hair, but it was fast and thorough, scoring a pickup average of 93. It works better on hard floors compared to carpets, but even on carpets the performance was decent, scoring an average of just over 90. It also has niceties such as multi-floor mapping, no-go zones, and scheduling. If you're looking for a robot vacuum that can also mop, the Roborock S7 is worth a look. Number 1. A Robot Roomba S9 Plus A Robot's Roomba S9 Plus is one of the smartest and most thorough robot vacuums we've tested, which is why it's the best robot vacuum overall. It has advanced mapping, so it can record and remember a blueprint of multiple floors of your house after just a few trips. You can then specify individual rooms, and tell the S9 Plus to clean specific rooms on specific days. We suggest scheduling it for when you're out of the house, as this is admittedly a noisy robot vacuum particularly on hardwood floors. However, with an average pickup score of almost 97, it's a capable vacuum on both hard floors and carpet. We notice that it's better at picking up pet hair and kitty litter compared to Cheerios. This is usually the other way around, so it's actually better for smaller debris. The Roomba S9 Plus also comes with a self-emptying charging base. While you'll have to purchase replacement bags for this base, you will only have to empty the container every 30 days, which will save you a lot of time versus emptying the onboard dustbin. If you want to drop even more cash, the S9 Plus can also talk with the company's Brava Jet M6 robot mop and tell it to start mopping your floors after the S9 Plus is done vacuuming. That's pretty neat. Ultimately, this robot vacuum comes at a steep price, but it leaves little room for improvement. So that wraps up our list of the best robot vacuums. Hope you found this video helpful, and if so, please leave a thumbs up as I always appreciate that. Also, please feel free to leave a comment, suggestions for future videos or questions you have, as we love getting to respond to as many of those as we can. And if you subscribe to the channel, welcome to our valid consumer family. We've got lots more videos coming your way into. Till then, stay safe, stay awesome, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.